Hello YouTube, welcome back to another video, and this is a video that I've recorded many times. And this is what if Naruto went back in time. So let's get into the video. Wait, oh, wait, nigga. So this what if starts off with Naruto during the Ishiki fight. So when I, yes, Naruto during after well actually after the first Ishiki fight. So when Ishiki puts all these you know those rods into Naruto, he's forced those rods into Naruto's chakra point, forcing his chakra into Naruto's like how Pain did. Now Nar this start started a. Sudden build up of Naruto and Kurama's chakra, along with the build up of Ishiki's chakra, which eventually created an explosion which created the same energy that the time turtle uses to go back in time. And he, when Ishiki lifted the bow back up after feeling this energy explosion, we see that Naruto is no longer there, which was smart, but then he would realize that if that energy was uncontrolled the way the time turtle does, as then boom. The entire timeline would disappear. That entire world, Naruto's entire future, is gone. No more due to the changes of the timeline. That world no longer exists. So, now Naruto um, will wake up eventually. As Naruto looks around, as he sees Sasuke and Sakura. As he says, Sasuke, Sakura, why are you guys using the transformation to look so young? As Sakura, as Sakura says, shut up, Naruto, you idiot. As Naruto thinks Sakura hasn't called me that in such a long time. I wonder what's changed. As he dance, he sees Sasuke go, hmm, like he always does. Since he hasn't done that in a long time either. What's changed? Naruto would then lift his hand up, but then he would see it. it's a lot smaller than normal. Then he would stand up and notice that he's wearing his old orange jumpsuit. So, Naruto begins to hyperventilate, and Sakura and Sasuke run to Naruto. Naruto's basically having a panic attack. They take Naruto into the hospital, and Kashi would arrive if you've seen that none of his students are there and will search around the village. This is when he will find out that Naruto had a panic attack and is currently in the hospital. So, Naruto would eventually pass out and would wake up in his mindscape, still hyperventilating. As you know, um, Naruto would call off Kurama, to which two red eyes would open. What do you want, Naruto? And what have you done? Why do I feel younger, yet still the same power as much as powerful as before? Probably more. I, I I don't know. What do you mean you don't know? I I, I woke up in the I woke up in the force where we were supposed to meet Kakashi Sensei and bam, I'm young again. I don't know what happened. QB <laughs> says Naruto. If you're young again, then it means we're back in time. And I can tell since the gate, since this seal is still on me. Could you please take it off? So it says, all right. Naruto begins to channel, con uh, channel chakra to his hand for the seal to appear, for the seal key. Naruto will hit his seal as his father will appear. It's about to stop him. But due to Naruto's being, you know, a Hokage, he will grab Minato's hand. Which, before twisting the... Before twisting the um his hand all the way and opening the seal, it's meaning to say no. What have you done, Naruto? Naruto says, Dad, what are you? Right, I'm in the past. What? It's hard to explain, but basically, I'm Naruto from the future, who's been sent back in the past somehow, some way. Apparently, I'm stuck in my old body. Um. I've never heard of wait I do remember something like this happening before I met this one boy who looked just like me with whisker marks he said his name was Naruto too 
and said that he was a said that I was the fourth Hokage or something. This was well before. I remember, I remember this. Something with the Leyline incident is from what I got. As the memories were hitting Naruto. Naruto says, so we've met three times? Man. As Minato says, okay, why are you here? We need to get you back. It's not to say there's no going back. We can't, I don't know how to. See what happened. We don't mean Kurama don't even know. Oh, Kurama. Sakibu says, me. As Minato will turn and we'll look back at the son. He says, you know his name? Minato says, I forgot. This dad hasn't met, um, doesn't know that yet. <clears throat> Anyways, I don't have time for this. It's Steve, I have to figure things out. As Corona say, "What well, are you guys gonna come out?" It's not until we ask Corona, "What is he talking about?" When Naruto would then see nine, um, not nine, eight other, um, eight other shadows coming from deep within the cage. Now these are noticeably a lot shorter than what Naruto normally said, normally saw. Naruto says, why are you guys so short? Because the cage wasn't big enough to fit us all. <laughs> oh. That's why we stay in that shared mindscape, but since we're back in time, that doesn't exist anymore. Right. Didn't know about that. Forgot, actually. Yeah, I bet you did, Naruto. What have you and Karama done? What have we done? We don't even know. As he's, Asabu says, I believe they're back in time. I know you guys felt their energy pulse before we before we are all flung into this cage. Yeah, I felt it once before. Karama says, yeah, I remember something about that. In the past and in the future. What? You remember how you just. I, I think I know what happened. What what happened? Okay, Naruto, you remember when your son and Sasuke left to go back into the past with some stupid turtle thing? Yes. I believe that explosion recreated the energy that it used and sent us back in time. But that's the thing about time. I believe that exposure erased, completely erased your world. You're now in a new world where mostly everything is the same as it seems, but some things might change. Some people you love might not be, might not love you. Naruto's eyes are white and says, no, Inata. There's a chance she doesn't love you, Naruto. There is. Boruto. Himawari. Village, it's so my fault. They're all dead. Yes, that is true. But you can recreate that now. You're back. You can save Itachi. You can save Haku, Zabuza. You can save a lot of people. You could even save Obito. Right, and Nagato, Konan. You're right. I can. Don't focus on love right now, Naruto. Let it come to you. Whether it's from Hinato or from a different person. I know you love Naruto. And, um, I know you love Hinato, but sometimes things happen. And you end up in these type of situations. Okay, that never happens. But you end up in this type of situation. Since you're right. I'll have to deal with this. Well, kid, you're waking up. You should probably leave the mindscape. And as soon as you get done with your graduate, your um, getting an exam, you should probably go test out to see what abilities you retained. From what I can tell, you could, you still have um, you have to fight me again, most likely. What? Yes, you will have to fight your other half. But this one is the it has the strength of your child self, not your future self, as you conquered that in your future. Oh, that should be easy. Yes. So that means don't perform any of your jutsus yet. 
Where could I find him? You'll have to wait to after. Just right. <clears throat> is Naruto wakes up is in the hospital. Kakashi says, Naruto, are you alright? And she says, Hey, Kakashi Sensei, how are you? Um, I should be asking you the same thing. The team they told me you had a panic attack and eventually passed out. What happened? Naruto says I don't want to talk about it. Can we just get on with the test? Naruto says you should be fine after waking up. You just had a panic attack. This is I really don't know the medical things behind a panic attack, but this is what I'm going with. Naruto gets up and leave and they leave the hospital to go to the training ground. So Kashi decides to take it easy on the team since you know Naruto legit just got out of the hospital. Whether or not he had a panic attack or a serious injury or not. So after the bell test, Naruto there's really no point in going over this. Most things will play out. Naruto will try to get everything to play out much the same. <clears throat> so Naruto will leave and will go into the forest of death by sneak by well by using his extreme speed. And Naruto noticed that none of his physical powers have dwindled. He has his adult strength, his adult speed, all of this, but he's just stuck in his child body and in the past. <clears throat> Naruto um while in the force of death decides to fight his to fight his evil half now to get to get control of Kurama. Naruto will begin to meditate as he will enter the mosque cave. As Naruto will say, "Kurama, where is he?" Kurama says points to a door and says, "In there is where you should find him. This is where he slumbered for years until you were ready to face him, constantly feeding on your hatred." It's just thanks, Karama. Yeah, hurry up. We need to be as powerful as we can if we're gonna fight them, all those people again, and save the world. Naruto says, Yes, right. So, um, Naruto will enter the room and says, Half evil half will wake up. Finally, you've come to face me. What's with your power? It's stronger than mine. That shouldn't be it. We should be on par. It's not just says, I'm so very sorry for this. But it's time I conquer you. It's not until runs up and hugs him and says, Don't worry. Everything will be fine. You are a part of me and always will be. See, you can rest now. And we can become one. So now Naruto is defeated as the other half. It, it was a lot faster than normal. He didn't really have to talk no jutsu that much into it. But kind of somewhat did, but kind of didn't. Anyways, Naruto will leave and we're done. Kurama will say, go on, kid. You can take it. You earned it the first time, so there's no point in putting up a fight now. Naruto will smile and we'll do the same thing. So a couple, you know, couple minutes later, Naruto um, would have had Kurama's chakra pulled out and onto itself. <clears throat> and then after Naruto enters his case on one day, he would then both fist with Kurama, entering his second, his um, version 2 of Kurama Chakra Mode, or QB Chakra Mode, case him 2. Naruto then sits on a branch. As he begins to meditate, as he sees it, he can still enter stage mode. Nothing has really dwindled in his skills. He's as strong as his adult self. He has all of his adult skills. Towards Naruto will then start calling upon Jutsus. He will make a QB, a QB avatar, but wouldn't make it big enough for, you know, the villagers to see. It would be just big enough so that he can practice and everything. So Naruto will do the Tail Beast Bomb by saying Shurikens, his KK Genkai, which he got from the Tail Beast and all that. Naruto says, yes, I still have it all. Good. Now find out what's wrong with this um with this timeline. Naruto says right. Naruto leaves to go on. And this is where we're gonna be ending off part one of what if Naruto went back in time. I know I'm ending it off shortly, but I'll pick it up in the next part and land the waves. I'll see you guys later. Peace and goodbye.